saint. Righteous bondage. All right, greetings to the Arc Saint here, and uh, we're going to be doing another first impressions video with River City Ransom Underground. All right, now this isn't. Uh, well, let me turn down the audio a bit. Yeah. This isn't going to be like uh, all the other first impression videos I did. Uh, I have played this a bit, uh, and I was intending to do it a lot earlier, but I got sick, so um, I wasn't able to get the video out uh, as soon as I would have liked. Um, but I still, I still have first impressions about it. <laughs> Um, what up here? There is, uh, in case you're not familiar with River City Ransom, it's, uh, it's an old NES game. I played it when I was a kid. Loved it, one of my favorite games, so super thrilled that they remade it, and, uh, I was also really sad that I couldn't, uh, back them on, on Kickstarter. I was having a problem with my, my card or something at the time, and, um, wasn't able to, to support them to make the game, but I am glad they got uh, to their goal and, and eventually got the game out, I think years later. I can't, can't remember how long it's been. But they've been working on this one for a while, so um, I think there's something like 10 characters you can play in the, uh, in the story or the campaign mode, and uh, they all have different skins for them. And uh, I think there's a there's an arena mode where you can play like 55 different characters. It's it's pretty crazy. And as you can see here, you you know it's up to four four players can play. And uh, and there's a multiplayer and co-op and online arena mode as well. So there's quite a bit to this game. Pretty nice. Oh, whoops, I already did this. Um. Gonna be continuing off where I was before. Now, the thing with uh, the thing with this game is you start off extremely weak, and uh, like I said, I've already been playing a little bit, and so I'm kind of into it. I'm about dead here, so you can see my health at the top there, top left. It's a, it's a green bar. You restore your health by eating food or going to a sauna. So let's see, I ate a burger. Um, You start off really weak, you only know basic punch, kick, grab, um, and then you you uh, train at dojos to learn combos and things of that nature. <laughs> um, I've been playing Rudy a lot because he's a, he's a wrestler, and I just got into grappling uh, uh, in real life, and so... <laughs> Uh, he kind of interested me the most. He's a slow character, very slow character, but he hits hard. Um, oh, that's the thing with the grapples. When you miss a grapple, you enter this state here where you're pretty much helpless. <laughs> he's a wrestler, so he's got the... Let me show you. Another thing about this game is they throw tons of enemies at you. It's a very... Uh, Say, it doesn't hold your hand, let's say that. Um, fairly unrelenting. Whew! <laughs> and enemies. Ugh. When enemies die, they drop coins and... You use the coins to buy cheeseburgers and other things. And level up and... Uh, Money is a very big part of this game. I throw up. <laughs> uh, I gotta say, when I was first playing this, of course I was sick, so uh, that might have been why I was frustrated, but I was indeed frustrated at just the difficulty at the beginning. But once you learn a few moves, and uh, some of the moves are 
actually change to to moves that you learn later on, which I don't like. So you, you end up learning a move and it, it doesn't actually work, and you wonder why. Um, I think there should have been some kind of a notification or something next to that, but uh, since the game's been released, I think they've updated it with two patches, and uh, seems pretty solid. I haven't tried the multiplayer yet. Um, no one to play with at the moment. <laughs> but uh, yeah, they got these little safe houses all over the city that uh, you go to and you can save. Yeah. And uh, you can you can switch characters if you want. I was playing uh, What was I playing? Oh yeah, I was playing Alex because he has a beard. It's a very nice beard, might I say. Uh, Ryan reminds me of uh, of Kuwabara from from Yu Yu Hakusho because of the, the hair. <laughs> I really like that. Um, you got this fat guy who's a grappler apparently. I don't know. Um, Glenn kind of has man. What do they call those man chops or something? Kind of like Wolverine. Um, pretty cool. You can see each each character has a different um, uh, fighting style. And uh, so forth. So, actually, hold on. Let me <laughs> let me change controllers. My battery just died. Du -du -du -du. There you go. Please work. Thank you. Oh yeah. So I was on Rudy. Here's here's the skins. You can see um, changes the skin color and the shirt. You got one that looks like uh, the Incredible Hulk, which is pretty cool. Um, But yeah, the other character I was I was messing around with. Let's see here, Glenn or, or Alex rather. Skin. This is a standard skin right here. He's a much faster character. As you can see, um, might be more appealing to. Oh, I forget how you hit him on the ground with this guy. Has different move sets. Not good. Oh, I'm liking the speed. I'm so used to being slow. Or is it? Another thing that kind of sucks is that they don't share money. So. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's the back kick. Ah. Um, <laughs> threw sand in my eyes. Okay, uh, I'll show you a bit more of the game. This is just one very small corner of the town. To get here, you have to run through um, kind of a back alleyway. You know what? I'm almost dead. Let me go grab a burger real quick, and then I'll, I'll run back this way. Merv's Burgers! Dun, 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 dun. Nom nom nom. Nom 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 nom. Okay, let's get out of here. Okay, here we go. This way, the art is absolutely beautiful, and uh, very impressed with how they did that. Ah, man. Um, every area you run into is pretty much going to have enemies, but you don't have to fight them; you can just run past them. And see, see what we do. They're not sure how um, annoying multiplayer would be because you'd have to wait for somebody to follow you. Uh, switch areas. Whoops. Oh, another thing is that enemies can kick you into a different area <laughs> if you're not if you're not careful and reset the whole thing. Yeah, so you gotta go through the arcade here. This is really well done. These nerds, the nerd gang. Ah, they throw bombs at you. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Wait, you know what? I think it's down. I don't matter. Remember what it is. Coins. Maybe it might be down. Punch. Let me check the moves. Those right here. Down. Oh, down G. Oh, okay. Oh, that's another thing is the moves list. Um, they will not mimic your... I'm using the Xbox um, 360 controller. G is grab, P is punch, K is kick. You know, it's pretty basic. Um, you figure out what those are. You go from there. Yeah. Yeah, he, like, picks them up and throws them against... An invisible wall. <laughs> ah. Ow. Stupid nerds. But um, the game was pretty cheap. I was surprised. It's like 20 bucks, but it was like a 20% discount, so I can't remember, it was like 18 bucks or something. Anyway, um, I snagged it. First day buy it for me. Um, here's one of the dojos. I think this is a starting dojo, you, you find out. And here you can see all the <clears throat> the moves that you buy. Some of them are pretty pretty pricey, so you gotta go for quite a, quite a while without dying. Uh, when you die, you lose half of your money, <laughs> which can really suck if you have a, a bad um, a bad strain of losses. And, uh, so yeah, mall area. There's a highway. Um, there's some weird shops like this one, Queen of Cats. I wish I could go in there. It's nighttime. There is a day-night cycle, but. Uh, yeah, you can buy a cat. I don't know why you'd want to buy a cat. You also gotta watch out for pedestrians because... Um, if you end up doing criminal acts in this game, you will get the police called on you. <laughs> Which I, I don't really like because you have all these gangs running around on the street and you got you know, those nerd guys throwing bombs, I'm like, why don't, why don't you have the police called on them? I don't understand. Not to mention you got all these different gangs, but they all, for some reason, gang up on you. I'm not, I don't get that either, but... Oh, there's the jocks! It's really cool, because uh, each, each gang fights it differently, they got different moves, and you gotta you know, look out for them. That guy there in the white, he has uh, like a brass knuckles and he throws sand in your eyes, I think. Or maybe it's the, if they have, uh, um, what do you call it, sunglasses on. And then those jock guys there, which are doing the, um, taunting animations, let's say. <laughs> They're pretty much, they just got grappling and wrestling moves for the most part, but they do a lot of damage. I was thinking about doing a Let's Play about this game, but I don't know if that's really a good idea, because um, I'm not 100% sure how to go about a lot of this stuff. There's so many secrets in this game that um, I'm sure I've yet to even uncover, so... I kind of miss Alex, I haven't played him in a while. Get me some coins, this guy right here, yeah. There's stuff in your eyes. Oh yeah, of course you can block. Forgot. 
seems like they got a taunt, and then uh, if you fall for it, they'll do like a, like a lunge. Ooh. Come on. The, I find the, these guys with the hats here, they're the most annoying. They hit you and they run away. That's pretty much their style. Die, you! Enjoy. And there's weapons um, you pick up throughout the environment. Pretty nifty. They're not quite as effective as I, I would think, think they should be. Um, well, these are the Necro guys. Mainly because uh, I guess the game has uh, uh, the AI counters button mashing. So if I just keep hitting the punch button, they react to that, and they're able to counter that pretty easily. And so with, with a weapon, you can pretty much just do that or throw it. <laughs> so... I'm not sure how to get the... Um... Whoa, what was that? I haven't fought too many of these... Uh... Necro guys yet. I don't really know all their, um, their fighting stuff yet. Die! Oh wow, they get up real quick. Woo! I like you, the coins. Sorry, <laughs> I've been uh, supposed to be showing you stuff, but the fighting is so much fun in this game. It's really well done. Alright, let's, let's continue on. Yeah, there's, there's a subway system where you can kind of get around the city a lot faster. And uh, this is pretty much the main hideout. As you can see, this. This is pretty much the in-game Alex, and yeah, I didn't know they were gonna do that. Um, to, one of the reasons I switched his uh, his skin uh, to having black hair, because I have black hair and I have a beard. Too bad there's not like a bald guy with a beard or a buzz guy. I have the buzz head, but uh, yeah, that's why I switched him in the first place. Uh, because they, these two characters actually, um, uh, they talk to you in missions and, and, and things like that, so having a carbon copy is kind of weird. <laughs> There's a lady here, she's sleeping, but um, she gives you updates throughout the city of stuff that's going on. You got a, a world map, here's the city, and it shows you where you are, the blinking, and then... Um, see throughout where you go. Um, I don't think I've been able to go everywhere. Some areas are like locked off at the moment. Not 100% sure how to get through them. Uh, again, I still haven't played too much of this game, so... <laughs> um, still don't know 100%. But uh, this is the park. I remember the park from the first game. I don't know if they'll follow you up here. Probably not. And over here there's a... Kinda looks like a... Soccer area. Or volleyball, rather. There's no net. But yeah, super, super cool game to look at. Get that egg. I still don't know if there's anything to that. You can't punch this thing. You can punch that guy, <laughs> but you can't punch the 
this giant egg thing. It's weird. Uh, Adam Park. So I think the overall arc of, uh, ow, you jerk, overall story is, um, some guy's daughter was kidnapped, I think, and, uh, there's a reward offered if, if you go and, and save right, I believe that's the story, just off the bat, off the top of my head. Man, I'm glad I'm I'm doing this first impressions on Alex because I <laughs> I don't do this good on on Rudy. Even though he's much higher level, his his attacks are so slow to get off. No. Nah. There's also an, uh, an energy bar, it's that blue bar over there, um, which you get special attacks. For example, this this back kick. Ow. That'll take some energy from there. It's a special ability. Um, I don't got too many abilities that do that yet. <laughs> it's fun to do. Die already! There we go. I think if you stay in an area also, uh, enemies will just keep coming eventually. So it's definitely worth um, not going AFK when you're just standing out in the street. But check out the sauna. This is this is right from the right from the other game. This this gives you like 60 stamina. Stamina is like your health, and so pixelated butt. <laughs> Alex sweated out all the tension. Stamina improved by 60. See, I'm good to go now. Um, there's also stats you can see here, and you increase those by eating food. So food doesn't just heal you; it also uh, you know, increases your attack, your agility, defense. And I don't entirely know what everything does yet at the moment. Um, where's that? Ancient food Myos. Yeah, here we go, Myos. You talk to this dude. And uh I'd like to here we go. Um Octopus roll. <laughs> um let's not eat that yet. Just because that'll heal me a little bit. But you'll see You'll see it'll give me a whole bunch of stats. Whoops! Oh man, I totally just robbed that one dude. Crap. Um, I don't know if they changed it or what, but it's like... If you just hit... You can hit these parking meters here. Or you can hit like the, uh, the token things in uh, the arcade. And get money that way. And uh, you'll get the police called on you. <laughs> And it's pretty much like GTA, like you got, I think it's like police levels, right? So, um, And they're pretty hard, and in addition to being hard and more enemies on the screen, they don't drop any coins when you kill them, which really sucks. So... Nope. Oh, damn. See, there's all those. Ow. Yeah, they got these, like, this ground bite thing. It looks really weird. I don't like the, the, uh, the weightlifting gang. <laughs> the jocks. I guess you call them. So you beat people up and you take their money and then you uh, you pay dojo masters 
to teach you things, and then you eat burgers, go to saunas. Uh, that's pretty much River City Ransom. <laughs> okay, let me eat that octopi, octa... Um, whatever it was. There you go. Octopus roll. Alex thought he could feel the tentacle hold on to his uvula. Stamina improved by 25. Max stamina is maxed out. Did that early. Earlier. Strength went up by 3. Weapon improved by 1. Throwing went up by 1. Yeah. Oh, see, more people just came out of like, nowhere. Um, but yeah. Uh, there's also a red bar that appears beneath uh, your stamina bar, your health bar. Not really sure what that does. Wow, that was a good. Money, monies. Finding multiple people are so much easier on Alex. Ow. No, don't bite me, you lunatic. Chidori's. Alright. People have baseball bats. <laughs> Ten bucks. Now I'm rolling in the monies. Pitfalls. I've yet to fall in a pit. I'm guessing that's insta-death, so... This is the area I was talking about before. This is the park. This is like right out of the original game. Um, die! Yo. Of course, enemies will pick up. Ow. And you get dialogue at the bottom for... Uh, for like story stuff. That's the thing that is blocking my way into the forest. I'm not 100% sure how to get past that. <laughs> um, now, see, usually when you pick up weapons, it kind of backfires. But, anyhow. Um, this is pretty much River City Ransom Underground. Thoroughly enjoying it so far, and uh, would recommend it. It's uh, again, this isn't um, this isn't an easy game. <laughs> Ow! Get how you get to the other town. Let's see if I can. Oh, there's a dog. That's nice. There's a comic book store. I got here. Clicky mark. Red beef stick. Hot dog. Sure. Nice. I don't know what a hot dog gives you. That's the first time I. <laughs> Alex like that he couldn't tell what animal this came from. Oh. That's, that's a plus. Um, a lotto ticket? I don't know what that does. Hot dog increases the strength. See, there's got to be a wiki some way, uh, somewhere telling you what increases what. Um, and there's not a whole lot of hand-holding. And... <laughs> that's another thing. If, if you're running around, you better watch where you're running because you can smack right into a into the wall, and it takes a while to get back up. Anyway, um... Uh, no, I think I'm gonna have to go back the other way. Okay, I'm gonna try to get to, uh... the other place here. Oh! Oh! Oh man, and then you got those big guys there. 
that break out of walls every once in a while. Ow! How, what's a nerd doing over here? Ow! Oh, crap. Okay. Focus! Get up! That I might smite thee, sir. Ooh, nice midair black. Uh, big guys are no joke. Bear with me, I must defeat a big dude. Whew! Can I... no? Yes, die! They drop the gold coins. Not sure how much money those are, but... I'll take it. Back up, dude! Just walking down the street! I don't know what the deal is. It's like you can't go in the, uh, the walls they break. That'd be kind of cool. Secret. Okay, cool. Um, Carnage's way. I don't think I could have went in there before. Anyway, all right. Let's get to. Um, save checkpoint or something. <laughs> then I'll try to get to that other place. What? Ow! Jerk! Okay, there's a save checkpoint here. Somebody's sleeping on the couch. The music is, is really awesome. I'm gonna do another sauna just because it gives you so much health. Um, okay, yeah, you know what? I'm low on, I'm low on money, so let me try to, let me show you the... Let me see if I can get the police called on here. No, oh, that's weird. I wonder if they'd change that, because the police would usually... They'd usually come by now. Taking money from there. Neither. I guess I'll consider this my public service cost for cleaning the streets. <laughs> There's also soda machines you can uh, punch and get soda from. And that got the police called on you too. Ow. Well, that's curious. Let me run this way. Um, but a lot of the soda machines didn't work, so I don't know if they fixed that yet or not. Uh, curious. Reset my spawn point here. Alright, yeah, check out the subway. I didn't realize you could get on the trains until I tried it. Um. Ow! Of course, there's jerks on the train. There's jerks off the train. Did somebody, like, piss all over that seat? Ugh. Or did they vomit? <laughs> That's gross. You pretty much gotta fight until the train ride's over. And, uh, and then it... You don't walk towards it, you just get off. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. Oak Hill Station. There's a pork machine. I still don't know what that does. Oh! Okay. See, now I'm in trouble with the... the popo, the police. Breaking vending machines is cool, but, uh, whoops. Messing with a pork machine, not a good, not a good idea. Okay. So you get the police showing up here, there, and if you beat them up, more will come. And I really don't know how to get rid of them other than juice, <laughs> other than um, hiding. May I help you? 
I think I bought everything. Oh, Spartan Kick. Oh, I could almost afford that. I don't know if I'm high enough level, but I definitely want to try to... Oops, sorry citizen. Yeah. Police. Can't you see there's gangs everywhere? Yeah. <laughs> Report reports of resisting arrest. I think the other one was uh breaking or vandalizing stuff. Pretty tough. Let's see, they don't drop any coins or nothing. It kind of sucks. But anyway, let's see if I can afford that now. Yes. Cool. Spartan kick. Let's check what that is. Um, G from behind K. I'm gonna grab a guy from behind and then kick him. Oh, okay, that's kind of hard to pull off. Um, might not be able to use that watch one very often. There's all these weird people in the background here. Like, what's going on with these gyms? <laughs> oh yeah, chicken bird. Oh, pfft. just run that guy out. Um, I'll show you how to get rid of the police. You got to, you have to find a dumpster. Uh, let's see, find one. This is a warehouse. It's not good. I've yet to get tired of the music, which is a good thing. I like that old style music. Right, I don't know if I can do this without killing myself. Whew. A little bit of platforming sometimes in this game. Right. Oh no! Okay, there's a trash barrel over there. I'm not sure if that will work though. Uh, okay, here we go. So basically what you have to do is defeat everybody on the screen. Minus the pedestrians, obviously. And then you can hide in the... Ow! Jerk! No, I got sand in my eyes! No! That's a lot of dudes I gotta beat up. Why aren't you guys fighting the other criminals? Whew. People die already. I'm not sure what the highest um, tier of uh, police are now. Taser. I'm not sure what what they what they send harder guys after you or what, but right now that's what's happening. Oh, I don't I don't need more people. No money's no oh, my face Okay good. Okay, so you defeat everybody and then this appears in so you jump in there and then um, you look at the top right, that badge will disappear eventually. And you're good to go. You avoided the, uh, the law. Giving me time to get a boy gun. Nom, nom, nom. I like this smile, it's free. I have one smile, sir. <laughs> nice. I like Merv, he's a nice guy. Merv. Merv's burger. 
So yeah, that's pretty much River City Ransom Underground, and uh, I'm having a lot of fun with it. I'm kind of playing it in spurts. Um, it's kind of like a game you can pick up every once in a while and uh, not have to play it all the way through and whatnot, but I don't know, it might be, might be funner with, um, uh, with other people. Might have to have my, see if my wife wants to play. At some point, there is a female character, Proovy. She's like a breakdancer character, but, uh, yeah. So, so here. Uh, I highly recommend this game. Um, good price, and it was really fun. Blast from the past. Uh, but again, if you get it, uh, it's not going to hold your hand, because it's, uh... Pretty hard off the bat. See, I'm level two here. I'll just show you what I mean. <laughs> I don't think I got any abilities for this guy. So pretty much all I can do, whoops, sorry, person, is the basic kick and the basic punch. I don't have any kind of combos or nothing to that. So <laughs> you gotta, ah, man, you gotta um, buy all that stuff at dojos. So yeah, this this character is extremely weak. It'll take a while to grind up a bit before you before you're you're like my other character, just run around beating the tar out of people. So um, yeah, that's uh, River City Ransom Underground, and uh, my first impressions of this super positive, super positive. So um, I'd say pick it up. And thanks so much for watching. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed. And until next time, may the Lord be with thee.